So, I finally got to this game, the Knicks against the Magic. Here's an alley-oop to Wendell Carter and the Magic were off to a better start here with a 12-point lead in the second quarter. And they were a better team in the first half, but it wasn't pretty. It was a really weird offensive game. Here's Markel Fultz on the pull-up to end the second quarter, but like I said, it was a weird offensive night for both of these teams overall. Here's Emmanuel Quickly, who I really liked in this game off the bench. He was really, really good. And I really enjoyed how he played tonight. And Jalen Brunson was spectacular in that fourth quarter. He had 11 points to assist. He hits the step back midi. He was just clutching up, man. And it was great to see him just step up. Here's Markel Fultz. He was also really good. Here's on the spin move dunk. Oh my god. I mean, he's just a great all-around basketball player, man. I love me some Markel Fultz. But Jalen Brunson answers right back as he was all fourth quarter long man spectacular game from him truly spectacular he stepped up big in this game and then he made a bunch of free throws and paolo had to miss here at the end but well julius randall gets the board and the game was over because he made those free throws and no timeout so it was a prayer for the magic but still a really fun game between these two teams and the Magic have been a lot better. Paolo had 16 points on 15 shots, not his best offensive night. 21 from Markel, you got 13 from Mo Wagner, 18 from Franz Wagner, who was also efficient. They have been so good, man. And for the Knicks, it was Jalen Brunson with 9 of 13, 25 points, 5 assists. He was plus 13 with just one turnover. He was so, so good. Emmanuel quickly off the bench with 18 points, 7 of 15 shooting. I really enjoyed how he played. And... Julius Randle had 22 and 14 still. He's, he's just, you know, he knows how to put up numbers. And a great win for the Knicks against these, you know, frisky magic.